You can see the focus in the eyes of Klein Collins' Taylor Bennett at practice Tuesday, just days before the region championships. As a sophomore at last year's state track meet, she finished third in the 100 meters and second in the 200 meters. When her coach asked the team to write their goals out this day before practice, there was no question what Taylor would write. My goal is to win state in the 100 and 200. I think she's got her mind set on winning state this year, and she, that's what she's doing. She works for tra she works during track practice. She works after track practice. You know, she's out there. She's just hammer away, just trying to get better every day. And for Taylor, it's not just about winning the 100 and 200. She wants to break the state record in the 200. This year, she hasn't lost a race in either event to anyone in Texas. And as we saw, if it's just running a practice mile with her teammates, Taylor has to finish first. Losing just isn't in her DNA. You win some and you lose some, but I'd rather win more than I lose. <laughs> where, where does that come from? My dad. My dad, he's big on us being the best that we can be at the sport that we do. And he always tells us, you know, if you're the second, you're the first person to lose. So she wants to be first in whatever, whatever she's doing because it's in her. It's just in her instincts. She's not going to settle. She's not just going to back down. She's going to go for that challenge, and she's always going to make sure she's ahead, and she's going to do what she needs to do to get ahead. And when Taylor sets goals for herself, they aren't small. Not only does she want to get to the Olympics, but the speedy junior is aiming for the games in Rio just two years from now. And even that's not enough. Two years from now, I want to make the Olympic team, and I want to win. I want to medal. I want to have a medal. Not my neck. Taylor as a person is definitely driven. She has amazing work ethic. I think the first time I met her, she told me that she'll be going to the Olympics. You know, it's those long-term goals that are really gonna keep her driven. And I would definitely not be surprised if I saw her in the Olympics. And after talking with Taylor, there's no question she knows where she's going and why she loves this sport. If you practice hard, it shows. Like, it's, track is your own sport. Like, it's whatever you, the time that you put into it, it shows, so it's just, it's you, it's just you and the track. If you work hard and you win, then it shows when you get on the line. You better keep an eye out for this running sensation, because if you don't, she might just blow right past you. I'm Robert Land for High School Spotlight.